hello guys welcome back to my tutorial on google apps in this tutorial i'll show you how you can add uh, users into the group directly without uh, going into the groups console or the groups module of that particular group so i go into groups i go to that particular group and uh, you can see there is an option here add users to group here you can uh, add any user that is present in your admin console so this is a user and uh, you have to choose uh, a member or owner uh, role for the user you can also set manager role for the user but that will be set in groups console or uh, groups.google.com and uh, when you go to this particular group settings i will show you uh, that in my upcoming tutorial uh, here i am not adding this user but uh, to let you know here you can define the email address of the user and uh, click on add to add the user and then how you can change group info of a group uh, if you have uh, mistakenly added a group name that is not required for you or uh, suppose i did a uh, mistake here i can correct it i can change the group name here and uh, you can also uh, change the group email uh, provided you have not used this email anywhere uh, in google apps uh, before S if you have not used suppose i will change it to hr.dep which i have not used uh, yet and i'll save group info you see the group email id has been changed now uh, similarly there is another option uh, known how you can delete the group if i press on delete it will ask for an confirmation and uh, if you click on yes delete this group it will delete the group this is to let you know about the options which is very user friendly and you can browse yourself and check uh, but still I'll go into each and every option uh, I'm trying to cover it in my tutorials let's see about access settings so this is the groups console what I was talking about uh, you go to groups.google.com slash a slash domain slash forum and group settings so this will be the uh, link these are the access permissions uh, it is very uh, readable uh, like you can read uh, and you can understand what uh, settings you have to set according to your needs uh, here it's uh, mentioned contact the owners of this group who can contact the owners of this group uh, you can choose all members all members can contact all members and managers can contact so I s have set this option who can view members I'll allow only members and managers to view the members of the group view member email addresses who can view member email addresses if I click on all organizational members then everyone in the organization or in your domain all users can view the email addresses view topics topics are uh, uh, threads which are posted by users in the groups module I'll show you what topics are exactly when you go to the groups console you will see there is a uh, this is a type of forum where you can post topics so no topics are available in this group you can create a new topic here and uh, you can define subject content and click on post it will be posted in uh, the groups module I'll talk about this in detail in my next tutorials for now I showed you what a topic is so who can def view the topics but I'll set that to all organizational members and owners I'll click on save so these settings 
or these permissions access permissions have been set for uh, the HR department group I went to this module by clicking on access settings you can also directly go uh, to groups.google.com slash a slash uh, your domain slash forum group settings and uh, this link basically without uh, access permissions it will redirect you here and uh, then you can go to settings group settings and it will show all the group settings which I'll talk in detail but the access permissions are available here which we already set in this tutorial thank you for uh, watching my tutorial follow up uh, for other permission settings and uh, uh, every settings on uh, the groups module basically in my next tutorials thank you